Okay guys, lower your volume. We're gonna do some sound clearing here for you. Hey guys, welcome back. This week we're doing all zodiac signs. This read is going to be Aries. So you don't have to be an Aries for it to resonate with you. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. Don't make it fit if it doesn't fit. Know that roles can be reversed. If I say to you, it could be a person. I do talk a little dirty, so if you get offended, just find your way out of the read. Come again another day. Uh, personal reads can be purchased over on my website. Links in the description box below. I also have an Amazon wish list down there. And uh, merch can be purchased over on RitzAndRewards.com. All right. I accept PayPal, Venmo, and Cash App. What's going on, Aries? What is up? What's up with the Aries? What's going on for the next week? What do they need in here for their higher good? Retreat. Children. Okay, so maybe, maybe you're taking your kids, maybe you're taking your kids out, you're having a good time with your kids, maybe you're going to the carnivals, festivals, you may be meeting someone at one of these festivals, flirting, fun flirting, extend your, your lighthearted energy, so you're going to be running into someone that you're highly attracted to with, when you're with your kids you're retreating you're taking them somewhere all right Aries Aries you may be very religious also or very spiritual or this person may be your love life is influenced by religious upbringings and spiritual paths okay. so bottom of the deck What's that about? You're getting a cup of love. Someone's coming in to balance the scales with you, to feed into you emotionally. Are you making yourself a number one priority, keeping your eye on yourself, filling your own cups up, spending time with your kids, spending time with yourself, you enjoying yourself here, and really feeling fulfilled. The Aries energy. What's the Aries need to hear? All right, so you're retreating possibly away from somebody that was a thief in the night, very in and out energy with you. Okay, someone that, you know, maybe ghosted you or just, you know, they come and go as they please. This could be the mother or father of your children. Very emotional, very emotional person. They, they get their feelings hurt really easily. Flirting. Partnership. All right. So you're flirting. Maybe you're flirting back with... Maybe you were separated from this individual and now you're having communication again with them. Coming back in with messages. If you're wanting a family. You might have one daughter. Someone is no longer holding back and being greedy with you. All right. This is four of wands. Some Virgo, Hermit. Hmm. All right, so it looks like someone needed time and space away from this connection in order to see things clearly. What's this communication coming in? The King of Swords might be an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. The communication is that they, they started therapy and they're feeling better about themselves and they're wanting to move this relationship forward and show commitment they're wanting to come in and, and express themselves to you guys. Let's 
So this person was emotionally damaged. That's why they had to seek refuge. They, uh, yeah, they were sabotaging, could be a Capricorn, sabotaging themselves, you know, playing around with their addictions, constantly needing to be high or drunk or pilled up, or, you know, sexual addiction, constantly needing someone there to pet their pussy or their cock. Bottom line, right? Um, so it looks now, they don't want to look out, out in the distance anymore. They will, they turn their back away from you to explore different things, to explore themselves. Now they're like, okay, I did what I had to do. I'm coming back, I'm coming back in. I don't want to move away from you at this point. Taurus energy, Capricorn energy, Virgo. This person, even though they're like doing therapy, not speaking to you, uh, is having them stressed out. Uh, this person feeds themselves a lot of illusions, a lot of false narratives here with the Seven of Cups. So they stay up at night, they're insomniac. Uh, they just don't know how to get out of their own emotions sometimes. They do want that rebirth, that love connection back with you, Gemini Scorpio energy. Wanting to reverse that ending. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> this is going to be hard for them to come back their throat chakra they they cry a lot this person cries a lot maybe a heavily depressed they come back in trying to you know spice things up you know pet your wand pet your pussy and get that fiery climax going this person's wanting to come out of the cold wanting to come out of the hurt and the rejection and the sadness that they caused here so you might have felt backstabbed by this person or not good enough. So let's see if they're coming in more aware, more woke. Is this person, how's this person coming in towards the Aries? They're, they understand that they have to let their defenses down and they can't come in just trying to sex you up. You're not going to want new beginnings if they're just waving their wand or cookie at you. So they're laying down their guard and they're opening up. They're manifesting <clears throat> they're manifesting good things with you opening up their heart center now. Yeah, they're just tired of watching you from a distance, stalking you and shit. And they definitely are uh, trying their best to become emotionally balanced for you to come in with this quick uh, love message for you. So this person is coming back more well-rounded in their energy. Let's see what they want to say that they're unable to say to you. This is my love me, love me not oracle deck. Here he is. This person wants to say to you, unable to say to you. Oh, so they're saying it was our time to part. They they needed this time away from you. You needed this time away from them also. I love you. This person loves you. They're coming back in. That's it. Don't release me. I love you. I love you. Don't release me. So they're going to be begging. They're going to be begging. You're a fucking star see what they want to do sexually to you. It's my sexy time oracle deck. Sexy time. I'll wrap my hands around your neck with love. Uh, so you might, it might be a tumultuous, if I said that right, relationship. So they love and hate you. They're wanting you to take all of them. Take it all. Take it all. Anal action. Yeah, they like anal. They want to take all your package. They want you to suck it all in suck it up i can see your soul so they feel that there is a soul connection that they can't part ways with you uh this person is definitely a feminine energy regardless of gender all white cards out here is feminine 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 so they are really like 
emotional. They're very flowy with their emotions. And that's why they kind of like stay a little flighty in their energy. All right. So it's looking good moving ahead. Let's get a Moonology card since there's a full moon coming in. Oh, all right. They just want to switch shit out. Communicate. Fast communication. Believe in the impossible. So it may seem like it's impossible for this person to change, but they're making moves. Your dreams need a practical plan. See, they're not practical, this person. I don't feel like they are. They're stubborn, bullheaded, and just... La, 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 la. So they're, they're trying to take on a more practical approach. Be bold and make the first move. So being a feminine energy, sometimes we have a hard time uh, making the first move. And luck is on your side. So things are going to be looking up for you guys. Sagittarius, Taurus energy. All right, guys, that's what I got for you. Hope you enjoyed the read. Hope it did give you some clarity to your situation. I do appreciate all likes, donations, and kind words you give me on a daily basis. Don't forget, I'm a real estate agent here with a one-stop realty shop in New Jersey. So if you're looking to buy, sell, or rent, I got you back. Head over to Jesse Ray One Stop Realty and follow me on other outlets, guys. Remember to put down some feedback in the description box below. And I will see you on the other side. Keep yourself in high regard. Next up is Taurus. Bye, guys.